Hey everybody, welcome to this episode of the Disc Golf Answer DG Noob wants to know about positive turn. His he asks, why do I do that? Yeah, it's a good question. I've, I've seen some discs that have a positive turn number. One example that I saw reviews uh, the Discraft Malta. Does this mean it's just extra overstable? I know that all flight numbers are objectively objectively different. Oh, why do I do that? Thanks for the great content. New segments. Keep it keep it wrap. Real as possible. Real as possible. I guess. But, but I also know. not ironic that he said rap in today's. I know. I know. <laughs> um, okay. So if, if I was making flight numbers, then I would probably never make a positive turn number, but I understand why some people do it. And we have, we have a couple of discs that have positive turn. Um, the reason for that is, so turn is usually when the disc, if, if you throw it backhand flat, it'll, the degree to which it moves to the right or kind of at least turns a little bit to the right before coming back to the left. Um, there are discs like the Justice that just don't do that. They don't turn ever unless you have it the most beat up and it's a super headwind. Otherwise, it's just not gonna turn. In fact, when you throw it out on a big hyzer, Stable and even overstable discs on a big hyzer will just kind of follow the line that they're thrown on. Very, very overstable discs will turn even harder toward the ground, like almost trying to land vertically. That's what I think the Justice is like. I believe the Malta is that is that same sort of disc. Um, so why they do that? Good question. Um, I understand it because they are more apt to turn toward the ground instead of up. The other direction uh but i i do think it's a confusing thing if you think of fade on the left side of the disc and turn on the right side that's probably the simplest way to do it without saying that a disc has a positive turn only have turnover be up either a zero or less than that 